Okay, so we have a uh, liquid switch here. Uh, when you lift the switch up, the fluid inside connects the two electrical connections, which will uh, charge a capacitor and some other flip-flop circuitry, which will eventually fire a pulse to this solenoid and fire the ball. So you can see it shoots out there. The ball will come up this teeter-totter. It'll dump over into this water well, which will dump it onto the track. Uh, the ball proceeds down here. It goes through a laser pointer that's pointing on a uh, photoresistive cell. You can see it in there in the corner. Uh, when something breaks the laser beam, the resistance changes and then activates this servo here, which will dump the ball into the tunnel. The ball goes down the tunnel. Uh, it activates these LEDs when it passes on the track. The ball comes out this side, bounces off these springboards. Uh, the ball travels down here into the uh, ultrasonic range detector, which when it goes off, it'll uh, talk to some circuitry on the back of the Plinko board, which will activate the motor. The motor pulls the ball up the elevator shaft, dumps it on the track, down the Plinko board. Uh, then the ball proceeds to go in front of uh, a magnet with a magnetic flux sensor. When the uh, sensor goes off, it sends a wireless signal to the house, which, as you just heard, uh, plays a little tune. I can set it off again in just a second and we can actually see it. So when the ball passes through here, the micro then runs through its code loop.